I didn't think that I was going to bring a group in here who's going to quit. So, um, you know, again, it, it, as we like to say, playing hard is, is just the price of admission. That's, that's just comes with being on the team. You better play hard or, or you don't deserve to have a uniform. And um, uh, our guys played hard. We, we did keep possession of the game. We, we went zone. They shot an air ball, saved it. Uh, and Aaron Harrison hits the, the corner three over there and kind of kind of broke us. But, um, but nevertheless, it was a uh, good game. We, 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 we had some guys that underperformed. You can't come here and have guys underperform and, and win. You just can't. You got to have everybody playing on that top of their game or close to it. And uh, I thought Dane did. I thought Riley and, and Matt did. Uh, Wade was was awfully good. Um, uh, both of our point guards played well. Actually, Shelton played well. Um, but we had some guys that, that weren't quite as good as, as they need to be in, in order for us to win here. You got a question? Please ask for the uh, wireless microphone, please. Kevin Booker's been really hot for them, and he had a very quiet night. But like you said, Aaron stepped up. How difficult are they to contain with so many weapons that they can throw at you? Well, I, I think that um, what makes them, you know, the best team in the country is they can have guys have off nights. They can have a poor shooting night. Um, you know, they, they, their margin for error is 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 quite substantial. And um, um, so, you know, I'd like to think that we try real hard and do a good job on, on Booker. I, I think Booker is, watching him on film, man, he's, he's incredible. Um, but they, they just have weapons. And, and um, um, that's why they're good. Kevin, so many teams have come in and played them anywhere and really packed them in and sort of dared them to make shots from the outside. Did you guys make a more concerted effort maybe to take the three away from them? Um, I would say we just kind of came in to play our regular defense and, and um, I wasn't going to come in here and, and change everything that we did. And, or, you know, I mean, it, that just doesn't make any sense to me. Our team as a team is trying to get better. Uh, we're a work in progress. We've got some really good young players, and um, um, but there were certain guys that we sure didn't want shooting threes. That's for sure. And and um, uh, but you know you look down and they were four for six. That's you know, that's good. And that's that's good. That's get to the foul line 32 times and and, and make most of your threes. So um, maybe I'd like to think that. You know, we, we defended them well. I, I thought I, I thought I thought our defense was, was really good, and um, uh, the problem is so is theirs. We're on the side. We wait here. Okay, come. Kevin, you said uh, going into this thing, <clears throat> they might have the the best defense you've ever seen. The way that game started, what were you thinking about that that take on that defense, and then what what were you able to do to really give them trouble there later in the game? Well, honestly. I'm sure that to a lot of eyes, it looked like their defense was totally disrupting us. But this is what you deal with, and, and this it's kind of I'm kind of entertained because um, John can't come in here and talk about his young team tonight because my team's younger than his. <laughs> and, and if you guys want to check that out statistically, uh, they're 346 and we're 348. Uh, so we're, we're actually younger than them. and um, But I literally call a play that we've been running all season long for the first possession of the game and have a guy completely run to the wrong side of the floor, <laughs> which kills, it kills the playoff. You can't, you know, you can't, can't run it now. And so we end up turning it over on that possession, but we got everybody looking around at, at the one guy saying, where the hell are you going? And, and we had three or four things like that at the beginning of the game. It, honestly, to me, it, it was more us playing like we were temporarily outside of our minds <laughs> than, than it was anything that they were doing defensively. And at the first time out, I said, can we just go where we go, or like, like we practice? 
And um, it's, you know, let alone trying to make the shot once once we get to the shot. It's just let's just go where we're supposed to go first. And um, later in the game, I, I you know what? I thought we got out in transition against them. Um, we did a good job of pushing the ball and, and hitting our shooters on the wings and and um, uh, and finding our shooters and penetrating. And it was something we said coming into the game against these guys. You, you better penetrate to find somebody. You don't penetrate to go in and score over the top of them because that's not happening. And and I thought we did a good job of that. And I think that's why later in the game things opened up for us a little bit. Last one, guys. Last one. Kevin, did you in the transition? Was it just uh, trying to beat their defense before it gets there? Yeah, or? I mean, heck, it, as good as it is, you need to you need to try to beat it before it gets set up. As far as I'm concerned. Now, you know, I lost, so maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. But that that felt like as good a chance as any for us was to get down there and and, and try to beat them before they before they got it set. So, um, but again, congratulations to them. Um, I'm sure this will be a very entertaining season, or continue to be a very entertaining season for uh, for all the people that like the Big Blue. So, are we done? Yes. All right, Damien, thanks for coming. <laughs>